Hello everyone, this is Captain Kyle. I'm reporting live from the New Year's Party Con, the very first of this con. And I'm here with a Klingon. Hello, uh, Mr. Klingon. I'm not familiar with this particular species. What is your name, sir? I'm Kethas. Kethas? Kethas. I was going to say Gunjintite. Comes out loose. I can understand that. <laughs> So, you have been a cosplayer for how long? Um, about 25 years. 25 years, wow. And uh, do you wear this in your sleep? No. No, that's it's, good. It's very uncomfortable. I could imagine. <laughs> <laughs> but obviously you're a fan of Star Trek. Yes. And a fan of the Klingon Empire. I would hope so, dressing yeah. up like this. Dressing up like this, yeah. obviously. So, when you've gone to cons as a Klingon, have you had any interesting experiences oh, quite a few over 25 years can you give us some of the PG rated ones I believe that I can see where there was this convention um, this past July we okay. did down in um, no it wasn't July it was August down in Maryland it was shore leave and there was this 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 gentleman about your height actually who was dressed up like Zap Brannigan Zap Brannigan yes who would dress like Zap Brannigan? <laughs> I think you know. Uh, you think? Hmm. I have the pictures to prove it. Yeah, we're, we're not going to talk about those <laughs> pictures. <laughs> I'll pay you later. But it is my understanding that instead of just going to cons and dressing as a Klingon, which is fun all, all on its own. It can be. You actually have an organization. Yes, yes. The Imperial Klingon Forces. We've been around since 1994. Um, we do everything. For, we're, we're not really a fan club per se, or a cosplay group. We're more like uh, cultural reenactment, I guess you could say, of a culture that's fictional. Correct. So uh, I guess you could call it pre-enacting. Well, that, that is very cool. So with your particular group, now you're recruiting, and are you trying to like conquer anyone, or is it something? Or do you engage in other activities? We engage in other activities. We just try to get as many people to join us as, as possible. It's not about the membership. Granted, the more people we get, the more fun we fun things we can do, and the more charity we can help. Charity. So tell me more. What kind of charity work do you guys do? Well, lately we've been, uh, last two years, and we're about to launch it for a third year, is our Stomp Out Hunger campaign. Um, our Vice Chancellor, Zarkon, Todd Bowman, uh, out of Kentucky had uh, organized a uh, fundraising event that helps bring money and food and like blankets and supplies in for homeless shelters and food banks. Uh, we do, we've implemented this all across IKF, which is international. So we're helping people out in just about every state we have a chapter and, and in every country that we have a chapter. That is awesome. So people who think that cosplay is just about dressing up, they don't realize that some of these cosplay groups actually perform charitable services like this. Oh, absolutely. And there are tons of organizations out there that do the same thing. If I wanted to become a Klingon, yes. obviously I would need bumpy head. Unless I wanted to be old school, you, you know, can do old school as well, yeah. But if I wanted to join your organization, how could I find you guys online? Online, we are on Facebook. Uh, just do a web search for Imperial Klingon Forces, and our page or our, any of our groups should come up. Um, we also have a website, and that's www.i-k-f.org. And you can go there, and there's information on the organization, what projects we do, what events we do. Um, pictures there's resources on how to help um, other people and as well as finding chapters and finding information on being Klingon as well as other organizations that, that are in the same genre well that sounds very cool so this is your uh, first time at this particular con what do you think so far so far this is not bad this is a good first year event um, I thought it was a little interesting that it was on New Year's Eve and New Year's Day but overall, this is a really, really well done event. I am actually surprised how many people are here. Well, considering that a lot of the people who come um, might not be into the party scene, more into the con scene, 
I would say going to a con would be one of the best things you could do in the Federation. Yeah. Or the Klingon Empire. You don't want me to do my don't Kirk. Don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> do you not like Kirk? Or you just not like my version of Kirk? It's a bit heavy. <laughs> I don't understand what you're saying. <laughs> heavy? Heavy. My ship. Okay. Yeah. We're going to stop that right now. <laughs> Anyways. Well, I think that's about all we have time for right now. Okay. But thank you so much. It oh. was a pleasure. It was an honor. And uh, as always, everybody out there, have fun and cosplay on. Kapla! Kapla! Kapla!